Our video is about uniform circular motion. <laughs> <laughs> attached to a pole by a five meter rope on a frictionless sheet of ice. If the sled is making five revolutions per minute, what is the tension of the rope? Uh, what? What? <laughs> you ready? Mm-hmm. tell us about your date with Kendall Saturday night. Is that a no? Tell me when you're dizzy. Kevin, just stand there and look good. How long you want to do that? Alright. Our problem is about uniform circular motion. So for us, the saran wrap is our sled. And the pole is rotating around, it's Blake Killian's truck. Let's go. Action. All right, in order to solve this problem, we first need to visualize it. Here we have our outline of the sled traveling across its frictionless sheet of ice. From this, we can gather the free body diagram in which there is only one force acting upon the sled, the tension. The tension of the rope is given to us by this uh, summation of forces. The summation of forces would be the tension is equal to the mass times the radial acceleration. The radial acceleration is equal to the velocity squared divided by the radius. The velocity 
is equal to 2 pi times the radius divided by the period of the sled. The period of the sled is how, many, how long it takes for, for the sled to make one revolution. From here, we can gather that since the sled takes one minute to make five revolutions, that it makes one revolution every 12 seconds, which is the period, 12 seconds. The problem gives us that the radius is five meters and the mass of the sled is 25 kilograms. And we plug all of this into the formula and we get that the tension is equal to 34.27 newtons.